हेलो एवरीबॉडी एंड वेलकम टू माय चैनल कोडिक्टेड एंड वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो आई एम अ सॉफ्टवेयर इंजीनियर एंड आई एम ऑन यूट्यूब सो दैट आई कैन टीच यू थिंग्स बेस्ड ऑन माय एक्सपीरियंसेस सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट अ कोर्स व्हिच इज फुल स्टैक वेब डेवलपमेंट एंड इफ आई सेड फुल स्टैक देन इट मींस आई विल आल्सो कवर एडवांस्ड टॉपिक्स लाइक 3 जेएस वेब जीएल canvas pwa which is useful for work offline web sockets which is useful for at real time communication like live chat uh, we will create a responsive design control version control uh, testing authentication apis hosting web security seo optimization performance optimization and many more so here we can create a project from beginner to advanced level and in advanced level we will create a project uh, related to 3d so this course is going to be crazy and uh, after completing this course you can say that you are a full stack web developer so now we understand what will be the sequence of our course so first of all we will done front end basic in which we will complete html css javascript and version control After this, we will move on to the advanced front-end topics in which we will complete React state management, where we can start with context API, and then we will move on to the Redux. After this, we will understand and learn UI libraries like Tailwind CSS. We will pick Tailwind CSS and also learn Material UI. After this, we will move on to the backend development, where we can create the server and try to understand how backend work. and here we can learn node js express js data base in database we will pick mongo db which is no sql after this we will understand what is mongoose what is authentication and authorization and then in authentication we will learn jwt which is called json web tokens and after this we will cover advanced backend and apis where we can done restful apis and web sockets web sockets is actually useful for add real time communication like live chat and noti notification after this we can understand how can we optimize performance uh, here we can learn how how can we make our app fast uh, and learn lazy loading code splitting and caching after this we can understand how can we optimize databases learn how can we deploy and use serverless here we can learn docker and container and aws after this we can understand what is fetch api fetch api is actually useful to connect our react app to express js and understand how to make http request to our backend after this we can understand what is testing because testing is actually so important so here we can understand what is jest and react testing libraries and also learn what is cypress this is actually a end to end testing to simulate real user behavior after this we can add and learn lot of security like we can implement https xss csrf protections and all after this we can understand advanced front end like 3 js web gl canvas api pwa which is a progressive web apps so yeah we can cover all the topics and since full stack web d is very big so if i forgot um any topics then please tell me in comment section i will add those topics to my course and you can check out my web development playlist project project playlist and link in link in description where project uh, some projects are already available and i will continue uploading projects so we are going to start this course from tomorrow so if you want to become a full stack web d developer then follow this course with me thank you so much for watching this video hope you like this video